Welcome to the latest update program. The topic of discussion is Odysseus Moon Lander Launched. Recently, a SpaceX Falcon 9 rocket was launched from Kennedy Space Center in Florida carrying the Odysseus Moon Lander, a project by Houston's Intuitive Machines. The Nova C lander, deployed from the lander, is now on its way to the moon. If Odysseus completes its journey and soft lands on the moon, it will make it the first privately led mission to do so. The lander and its payloads are expected to function on the moon for about seven days till the lunar night sets in. This also meant that it had a very short launch window. Previous attempts include Israel's Bereshit in 2019, Japan's Hakuto in 2023, and American Peregrine in 2024, all of which failed to make a successful lunar landing. Specifically, the Peregrine mission by Astrobiotic encountered a propellant leak shortly after its launch, leading to its destruction in Earth's atmosphere. With the spacecraft targeting a landing near the moon's south pole, the arrival of the lunar night will render Odysseus and its scientific instruments inoperative. The IM-1 mission aims to gather valuable data on the lunar surface, aiding the preparation for the Starship's human landing system to deliver the first NASA Artemis astronauts to the moon. For the Artemis III mission, although Starship is set to play a significant role, the astronaut crew will be transported to lunar orbit aboard a space launch system rocket in its Block 1 configuration. Now is the time to test your knowledge. The question is, the Odysseus lander is planned to land near which area of the moon? Equator, North Pole, South Pole or Far Side? Send the answer to this question in the comment section. Thanks for watching. For more informative content, like, share and subscribe. And do not forget to press the bell icon to get the notifications.